All right, so I'm in the GX today. Um, just picked up the package, so y'all can kind of see it. Um, can't show y'all too much, but on the way back home, about to be in traffic for a little. I hate traffic so much, but gonna go ahead and try and install the mod tonight. Still can't let y'all know what it is. I don't know which video this is going in, but gonna try and install the mod, uh, the mod tonight. Gotta do a decent amount of stuff to get it on. So I'm um, trying to hit up a couple of friends, see who could pull up and maybe help the boy out because uh, this is gonna take a minute trying to get all this work done. But we are on the way back home. So package is secured. Yes, sir. All right, I already started opening the box for security reasons. Y'all don't need my address. <laughs> but y'all see what it say right there. I'm pretty sure y'all can tell what this is by the shape. Y'all can see what it is by the name on the box. About to cut it over. <laughs> oh, shit, boy. Only cut open a little bit. But damn. Y'all already know. I'm going to get it fully open. <laughs> Dummy. Dummy. All right, this is sick. Comes with an air freshener too. Shout out to Fly One Motorsports. Uh, this is their first part that they made for the second gen IS 250s, 350s. Um, gonna go ahead and get these installed. I don't know if I'm gonna do it today or tomorrow because I want to get these lined up real nice. The spots for the bolts are already marked up. You just gotta punch them through and then bolt it up. Gonna have to take off the front bumper, the headlights, and I think the side skirts as well to get these on. And then take our time to line everything up, but I think we'll go ahead and install them tomorrow. This is the driver's side. I'm gonna go ahead and check the passenger side, make sure everything's good, and then, yeah. All right, so what I was trying to say is, on the way to my boy's house, so we can install these fenders, um, it's probably gonna take us two hours, Hopefully, fingers crossed, um, nothing goes wrong, no bolts or seized. We got to take all that stuff off so we can get to the stuff for the fenders. Um, the first one is going to take longer than the second one. So um, I know it's a couple of people there waiting on me. We got my boy Z Jr. Um, I think K might be leaving. And I thought I heard a couple other people. So maybe we can get both sides going at the same time. Who knows? I'm try and speed this up. But I'm excited to hurry up and throw these on. I'm pretty sure y'all excited to see these as well because I haven't seen anyone else with these um, fenders make a video yet on YouTube. So um, don't quote me. I don't think I'm the first person to put a video out on them on YouTube for this for the second gen uh, Fly One Motorsports fenders. But if I am, then let's go. But yeah, 45 more minutes of this BS and then I will see y'all there so we can start this install. That was for the three. Gang, gang. All right, we about to get to work. I'm going to just set this shit up and y'all can watch the process. So, yeah. Well, that cracking all these. I'm going to do the headlights. You guys are going to want it? Yeah, it hurts you. You got air space? Yeah. What, it broke? Oh,
Fuck okay, game is done. Let it bang. I think Chris is, Chris is on. On the bathroom, you see, has the next key. That means you're checking the thing up. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, I think it's on. One more worker in it? Hmm? Nah, he's he's been with Wilmer too long because he's he's speaking Spanish now. Many unbearable hours later. I had to stop to eat a banana, but oh, we're struggling. It's a clip by the bottom of the rocker panel that we had to take out so we can get the rocker panel disconnected from the fender, and we can take both the OEM fenders off. So. Once that's done, then we're in business. Look at this mess. Man, this shit right here, not easy to take off, bro. That shit took us a good hour. Get in there, bro. <laughs> oh shit! There goes one. <laughs> <laughs> this is fuck my life, bro. Which one goes where? Eight hours later. So hard. So damn hard, bro. All right, something I forgot to mention about the fenders. The holes and everything for where the bolts need to go to put the fenders on are not pre-drilled. So you will have to drill them. Um, so the bolt up here, down there for the rocker panel and stuff. Every bolt that's on the stock fenders, there are cutouts and like indents where they go, but they are not pre-drilled. So you will have to drill them. But the fitment is, uh, I'd say really, really good. Um, with fenders, it's really hit or miss. Right here, I just need to tack this back in under here, but you can see the gap from the pillar to the fender is not that big. And then I haven't put in the weather stripping right here either. I'm gonna put that stuff back in. So that's why this gap looks bigger as well. But as you can see, the fitment is really good, especially around the headlight and the bumper. Same thing on this side, still gotta put the weather stuff back in, but the feminine is really nice. Really, really nice. Way better than it, it was better than it was before on my stock stuff, so. Yeah, man, Fly One did a great job on these. That's sick, so let's get it. All right, so I think that's where I'm gonna end it. Um, as far as the fenders go, let me know what y'all think down in the comments. The install wasn't necessarily hard. You just gotta take a lot of stuff off to get to um, all the bolts for the stock fenders, and then you gotta drill all the holes for the new fenders from Fly One, but I like them. I think I, I did some searching. I didn't see any other videos for the Fly One fenders for this car, so you might be the first ones on YouTube with them. There's a whole bunch of cars on uh, Instagram that I had these fenders before me, but I think I'm the first person to make a video on them on YouTube. This isn't like a full tutorial or anything because it's pretty self-explanatory what you have to do, so... Yeah, let me know what y'all think down in the comments. This is the end of the video. I'm currently in Philly on the trip. About to find somewhere to hoop before I go back down home to Maryland. So, um, yeah, I will see y'all later in the next video. Peace. Appreciate y'all for watching.